and they said they would come to see you. Yeah, no, me then, yeah, I ain't gonna hang your mother before we make giving you. Oh my God. What's up, my baby? I got my 13-year, 59 grandchildren, 1387 great grandchildren. <laughs> Jesus, I'd be calling on Smith and Wesson. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a pretty lady here. What's your name, baby? Robin. Robin. Is this your wife? Yes, it is. You treating her right? Yes, yes, ma'am. Got, got Proverbs down. You got Proverbs down. You got all the right scripture down on how to work the life. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Oh. All right, now, you, ain't nobody gonna get me no chair. I know I'm old, I can't be standing for all this time. I only got a few minutes before I go, they drug me after bed. I'm, I'm trying to get back into the to Ain't nobody got me no chair yet. <laughs> and I'm trying to get some sleep. I got to get up at the work in the morning at the plant. Yeah. I'm glad you need a mic. Uh, can y'all hear me? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, oh, oh. Did you find it? They asked me to come for a shelter. <laughs> Gotta be for. Hold me up, Jesus. Don't let off fall. Oh, crazy Lord. You know, this Mother's Day, I can't be giving that gift. It's got to keep my legs crossed. Um, they asked me to come and do a few words. Y'all come on down here so I can look at you, please. Because I want y'all to hear this too. But we only got a few minutes. People trying to get home to their mamas now. <laughs> yes, ma'am. As, as they say in the Baptist church, I ain't going to be for you too long. We read just a few words on the Mother's Day. You know, we, can't, we wouldn't have been nowhere without our mothers. Lord knows discipline is a big thing. I'm watching all this stuff happening out here nowadays. And I'm like, honey, if I was out there, they wouldn't be doing that. All I need is old leather strap or a couple of twi uh, we used to call them twitches. Twitches, because we couldn't even get the whole word out, because mama used to catch it so fast with them. <laughs> but all they need is a switch or something up on their rear end, and they'll be straight. But to all the young people out there, and everybody still got their mama, and if your mama gone, still love them. It's all about that love, because it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be where we are today. And we're looking at some of the kids now where their mamas at. They still babies themselves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they don't know their mamas. They don't know the family, anything like that. And so nobody trained them, so they don't know how to train nobody else. Because I know one of them I come out with across here. <coughs> oh, honey. I grab that. Oh, I'm in church. I, <laughs> I grab him up. I catch him and I wear that behind out. And, but they know now. Mm -hmm. One own couple of old businesses now. By Lord and mercy, they just doing what they supposed to do. Mamas, continue to raise your children in the way they should go. I think, Matthew, you're going to have to help me now. Proverbs 
But two, 22 and 6, and the train of child and the way they should go. And when they're older, they will not swerve away from it. Lord knows when I was younger. My mama raised me right and I was doing. And have Jane to come bail me out and pray for me because of time. <laughs> but Lord, she knew what a stash was, y'all. So she didn't have to do all the money. I always kept it under, it was in a big box, in a little box, wrapped up, hanging on a hanger. Used to keep it put away. But if it wasn't for her on her prayers, Huh? It kept me in my mind. I remember that the Lord guided me and He was keeping me out. He kept sending people like Jamie, Linda, even though I had her run around the pool hall. Yes, <laughs> she, honey, yeah, she knew that way. Watching all these young ones grow up and everything like that, and it's just been a blessing. So remember, train them children up in the way they should go. And kids, it might seem tough right now. It seems like I can't never do what I want. But if you go through it now, you're going to be able to get to where you can do what you want to do. Amen. I'm leaving witness. Honey, 98 years old. Mama, 115. She's still here too. <laughs> All right. The great grandma, 145. She's still here too. We, we, we alone in the family of young grandmothers. That seems to be no day. We got to do what we want to do because we stayed in the Lord and stayed in the Word. Amen. Amen. Baby, you looking frazzled. You love your mama? Where she at? Go hug. That's it. Go. Don't put your ankle. Put your mother back. Now, if your mama can't reach you, young ones, go hug your mama. So you can reach you. If there's anybody, that's ever done any kind of word of encouragement in your life, go hug them right now. Go hug your mama. Hug your mama. I know. They, they must not love them people. Yes, Lord. They might not be your biological. Men can be mothers too, because sometimes they nurture just as well. As long as somebody nurtures you. And gave you a good part It's hard. 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 It's Just remember, I'm going to leave you with these three things. Love God, love others, and love yourself. Because if you love God, he'll help you love others. And when you're on the right track and doing everything, you can love yourself without anybody else. And if you can't love yourself, how you going to help anybody else? That's right. Amen. All right. Sandra, come here. Because I'm just saying. I know you have to. <laughs> you told me that. I'm not ready. I wasn't ready. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know y'all got a new church now. I hope you got a church too. Let me go on the cloud. I know y'all got a new church now. I hope y'all got a church too. I fall out, sprawl all out here. Send me, make sure we got a church. Oh, bless the heart. Uh, nourishing. Nourishing. Oh, I'm nourishing. Now I'm trying to get up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I'm trying to get up. I'm trying to get up. Go.